How's it going everybody? Zero one of one back again. I'm not sure if you're gonna believe me or not, but this is now the fourth episode. And episode one is still not uploaded to YouTube yet. It just ticked up to 74%. And keep in mind, this has been uploading since last night. And it is now nearly three o'clock in the afternoon of the next day. Yeah. I don't know what's going on, but it's very strange. Anyways, uh, we need to unlock coal power. And so right now we've got stuff being made, hopefully. Um, yes, we've got 105, so we need 45 more of those, and we're going to need a ton of rotors, uh, which means we're also going to need a lot of screws. We have a decent amount of screws, I suppose. Um, making a bunch of rotors, which is going to be super, super fun, by the way. And we can only make 12 at the moment anyways, but... Uh, so what I'm thinking about doing here is, once we get this unlocked, I'm going to go down uh, sort of where the space elevator is currently, and go a little bit to the west, where there's some water, and I'm going to set some stuff up over there. Now, the only bad thing, though, is there are, you know creepy little monsters over there and they are all going to try to, you know, destroy me. So what I might end up doing is get this one first. And, uh, yeah. And we're just going to get that because, um, once you have like the, the baton, um, getting through, uh, all the other stuff is so much easier. Uh, you kill things faster, and then plus because the AI isn't quite uh, where it should be for the uh, critters, um, it's actually pretty easy to take them out. So, uh, let's see, I need some more of these. Might as well grab some more. Well, no, I don't need any more of those yet. Uh, but I do want to check how my iron is doing. Okay. Eh, about halfway done. Okay. So, once again, uh, this is challenge mode. We are not using automated miners at all. Uh, exceptions for oil and water, because we cannot currently uh, get those manually. Um, you'd think you'd have, like, a floating pump or something that you could put somewhere, but meh. It's cool. Alright, so we've got all that. That is now all the way full extra for that should be good um, how am I doing on concrete let me check and see what we've got are we out we are out of concrete but we have a lot in here so that's good so next thing I want to do is go up here and grab all this stuff I still have to build like a little platform on here so maybe I should work on that Because then, you know, getting all of this stuff is going to be easier because I'm not going to have to worry about, you know, getting stuck on this rock or whatever, you know, so. Alright, take all that, put it over there, good to go. Um, we could actually speed this up if we made all of this T2. Uh, let's see, I need a riser, or lift, what do you want to call it? There we go. Now we're going a little bit faster. Okay, sweet. So, uh, actually, yeah, let me, let me update these. Go, throw the rest of this into here. Good to go. All right. So we're gonna need this to go kind of across the middle here. So let me see what I can do as far as foundations go. I think that's 
kind of sort of what we want there. I think that should be fine. All right, and then we're going to build this going across the middle. And uh, no, no clipping. Okay, good. Sweet. All right, so that will be good for that. Uh, can we mine? Yes, we can. We can mine pretty much all the way to the end here. So let's go ahead and throw a ramp on here. Um, probably going to need stairs or something over here. There we go. And now we can go through here. Kind of cheat these things onto the platform and then it'll be a lot easier to collect out of these things. There we go. So these are all set up, mining away, good to go. All right, and they'll actually be uh, all the way full pretty soon, so that's good. Um, and then we're taking the 120, dividing it by three, so it's 40 here, 40 here, 40 there. I think these require 45, so we're almost at 100%. Uh, not quite there, but it's good enough for me. All right, um, let's see. Probably have checked the copper, make sure that that's good. Okay, we are definitely out of the ore. All right. Okay. So that'll keep our copper going for a little while at least. That should complete us for our wire. Then our cable is also done. So that can go there. All right, let's see what we got over here. How are you doing? And then I need another 12, 13. I don't know, I can't. I can't move this window at all, so. Um, well, there's 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, no, we need 13. Okay. So, oh, and we're out of screws anyways. Okay. More screws, please. Thank you. And now we're good. Okay, so with that... There we go. Milestone reach. R and D inflated your pocket dimension, added an additional hand equipment slot, nice. and have provided an improved Xeno Zapper with increased strength and range. That's what I'm looking for. Alright, so we need to make another Xeno Zapper. And with that we can now make the Xeno Basher. So we need wire, we need cable. Do, 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 do. There we go, there's our cable. Grab some more of this wire, I don't know. I don't remember how much wire I needed. Probably should have paid more attention. Oh well. Uh, yeah, definitely need more wire. And then also five of the modular frames, which we should have. Oh yeah. Um, and then I just need wire. But I need 500 total, so that's that's a lot of wire. And all of that is moving in there, so this is just gonna be slow. And so I'm gonna have to uh, grab, oh wow, that is all the way full, <laughs> nice.
All right, so I'm going to crank out some wire, and uh, yeah, that'll get me 200. So I'm just going to pause and crank through this real quick, and I'll be right back. All right, just finished that. Still not enough wire, unfortunately. <sighs> we only, only made 42 here in the time that it took me to make 200. Okay, we will do this again. Looks like the ship is coming back. Good. All right. And we're done. All right. So um, let me go and make that. There we go. Fancy. There we go. Send it out. Check out the little wrench on it. Bam. Nice. Okay, so with that, I feel a bit safer. Um, we have not yet unlocked coal power, right? We're still waiting on that, yeah. But it does keep all the stuff in there, so it's not like I have to go and do it again, so that's kind of cool. Um, that, we already got that. Uh, rotors, oh, did I just, I just used all my rotors, which means I have to make more now. That is unfortunate. And that's gonna need more of those, but then I also need these to make the rotors, so. Uh, I don't know, man. Eight, and I need 50. And then also, I used up a lot of those, too. But, I mean, I feel, like, a lot safer with, you know, this versus the little tiny, you know, poker. Like, if that's the poker, this is, like, the basher, right? It's much better to bash than, you know, poke. All right. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to... I'm going to do the thing, and we're going to... Try to get what we need, I guess. So I'm gonna pause, and uh, when we get there, I'll come back. All right, so it took a little bit, but we finally got here. We are now unlocking coal power. Milestone reached. Nice. Are added to each pipe section automatically. Okay. Ah, so before we get too far into this craziness, um, we're going to go on a trip. And I don't know how much longer this is going to last. Hopefully a little bit longer at least. Uh, we'll throw in like 40 in there, throw in like 40 in here. Oh, that one's already out. Okay. Um, but yeah, so we'll run out of uh, iron eventually over there, and uh, I'm not going to worry about that. But what we're going to do now is we're going to go on a quick uh, hard drive mission and see what all we can find. So I know that there's one over here somewhere. I know it's close and it's by water because it's like partially like falling in the water or something like that there it is right there okay oh hey um hi who where why are you so loud oh you're in the water why are you like in the water dude <laughs> you can't charge in the water. Anyways. Um, so this requires modular frame. Okay, we got that. So there is one. And 
Ada speaking. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to pick up all of the stuff around here because it will potentially help me out later on. So we got wire there. I think that's all pretty good. I don't think there's anything else over here. Um, all right, let me think. Um, there's another one, but it's like along the canyon. But I don't think we can get to it from that side. So I think we have to go this way. And kind of take like a long tour around. Uh, Caterium. I uh, don't need any, but it's there. I think it's this way. Fairly certain it's this way. And then the cliff is like right over there. So it's like sitting like right along the edge. I don't remember what kind of monsters are around it though. And we're actually going up a hill, so I can't slide jump, which kind of sucks. There we go. Okay, so here's the cliff. And it's kind of... Wait, no, the cliff is over here. That's other stuff. Okay. Hang on. Let me go this way. All right. Okay, so here's the cliff, and I think it's over here somewhere. There's a little slug under there. It's cool. Um, is that it down there? No, that's just flowers. That might hurt, or not. Okay. Nope. So it's not over here. Uh. Oh, I'm not gonna make that. Okay. Um, is it over here? Hey, little lizard doggo. Nice. Um, I thought it was over here. Is it like down here? No. Am I just like blind and seeing things? Oh, hey, check this out. Big guy. Ow. Anyways. I will take those, thank you. Uh, I could have swore it was over here somewhere. Is it, uh, did I go too far? Am I not, oh, there it is. It's all the way down there. Why is it down there? Well, I mean, I suppose they did change everything around here, so I suppose it makes sense that that got, oh, what is this? Huh, that's kind of cool. Um, wait, no, that's not the right one. That's the one on the other side of the whole thing. Um, so that means that I'm like way, way too far this way. Oh, I need to be very careful about jumping here. Uh, do you think I can make this jump? I think I'm not going to try. Although, yes, I probably could have. Um, yeah, I've not actually checked out this new area yet, so... Eh. Okay, it's got like a little faucet thing right there. It's crazy. Oh, I actually took damage from that. Huh. Um, I know you're over here, sir. So I've collected you before. Oh hey. Oh yeah, and you hit these guys like once with the with the bashing stick, and they tend uh, not to charge after you. Um, I would like to collect your remains. Thank you. Oh hey, what are you doing? Uh. 
Okay. Um, is it down there? No, it's not down there. Is it on the other side of this? Might be on the other side of this. I know it's over here. I know it's over. Oh, hey, some of these. Nice. This is one of multiple edibles we have detected. It's the in first food I've found. Oh, hey, another food. A new Thank you. Tree can now be accessed in the um. Hello. Do we have a, a wreck over here somewhere? Did they move it like completely so it's not even here anymore? I mean. Supposed to be over. Oh my god, don't jump that far, dude. Um, huh. Hmm. Are you. Wh wh why are you shooting at me? Stop shooting at me. That's rude. Is it. Okay. Can you, like, just stop shooting at me, please? I would really appreciate that. Okay, so there it is. I found it. And it's surrounded by poison plants. So that's that's cool. But I think it always was surrounded by the poison plants. So, I mean, it's just... It is what it is. That is a long way down. Oh, hey, um... Here we go. All right. Poison plants. Excuse me. I'd like to get through here. Uh, I'm getting poisoned from all directions. Okay, what do we need? A uh, rotor? We got a rotor. All right. What the? No, stop. 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 Dang it. There's like no safe place over here. Um, and I really want to grab... Whatever stuff. Ooh, there's a computer there, right, right there. I definitely want to grab that. Look at all this poison, dude. Can you, like, calm down, please? Like, chill out, dude. There you go. Now, sit your happy butt back down. Sit down. Thank you. All right, computer. Got the computer, okay. Uh, these, definitely want that. No, stay, stay, good. No, you need to stay too. Um, okay, you're kind of in my way, leaves. Okay, we got another, another thing over here, so we'll get that. We have some cable over there. Uh, that's just junk on the ground. We got another poison plant over there. So let's just do a quick little run around here. I think we got all of the important stuff. Okay, so that makes two hard drives, good. Um, and then as long as I'm doing this, uh, we might as well build ourselves a little ma'am here. Start investigating. There we go. Okay, so another poison plant over there. I'm just making sure that I'm not like missing like computers or something because those are super useful if you can find those early. But, okay, so I think, I think that's it for that. So the next one is going to be by our actual base. Um, and then down where I put the space elevator. So we need to head over that way. And then there's going to be a large spitter down there. Uh, what the, oh, we got more poison stuff over here. Ugh. Why? Um, we should be 
right over here. Yep. Okay, good. Uh, that is a long way down. Hopefully it doesn't hurt. Good. Um, all right, and then we're good here. Good here. All right, get her done. Okay, so there is our copper situation. I'm going to check out the power real quick. Everything should be kind of calming down once it all gets through. So that'll be fine. Um, let's see. So we're going to head down here. And then the next one is actually right down there. But we do have that large guy there. We also have that guy there. So we're going to have to be uh, very careful in how we do this. So first things first, I'm going to run over here, swat this thing a couple times. Keep that from coming after me. All right. Now this guy also needs power. OK. Let's throw in a biomass burner somewhere over here. Hello? Oh, I need rods? I don't have rods? Are you kidding me? Dude. OK. Let's go get some rods real quick. It's a good thing we're close to the base. <laughs> This would have been uh, awkward further out. All right, rods are in this one. There we go. It's a good number, I think, 200. And I also need to pick up a lot more food. If I get surprised by those uh, hatchers, it's just going to be kind of game over for me. Okay, so that is good to go. Biomass burner, good to go. Biomass. Throw some wood in here, I guess. There we go. Takes a rotor, a little bit of power, and we get another hard drive. All right. So uh, next thing is to see if there's any uh, goodies around here. So he's over there. We're just gonna swat at him a couple times. Wow, he just, wow, it's, geez, what, where is he going? <laughs> oh my God. Did you see him? He like went, slid, slid down there, bounced off the bean, hit that thing, started shooting that way. That is insane. Um, but yeah, uh, game is still a work in progress. So uh, yeah, fun times. Um, it doesn't look like there's any stuff around here. Why is there no stuff around here? You're supposed to have stuff. <sighs> okay, um, so now that we've got that one, uh, I think the next closest one is over in the desert area. There's gonna be a few over there that we're gonna go for. Um, is there really nothing around here? Dude, that sucks. Anyways, all right, so we're gonna try to skim across here real quick. So get ourselves some speed. And then so long as you're jumping out of the water, it seems like when you land in the water, you get like a little burst of speed. And I think there's a spider over here and I kind of want to kill the spider. These things are terrifying. All right, spider, where are you? There you are. Hey, I see you, I see you. Oh, hey, he hits a lot higher now. Come here, you. Dead spider. Look at these things. They're they're just terrifying. Just creepy. All right. Anyways, so he is now dead. Um, there's coal over in here. There's copper, limestone, and I think there's iron up there, but nothing in here that I need. All right. So uh, let's see. I need to not fall. Great. So you can see the AI 
uh, kind of freezes sometimes on these guys. Um, I mean, I'm not going to complain. It just makes them easier to kill. All right, so that is that one. And then there was another one over here too, right? I thought there was. Wasn't there? There was four that I killed, right? There it is. Okay. Good to go. All right. Let's try this again, only without falling this time. Preferably. All right. So we need to go this way. And if I remember correctly, this one's kind of on a slope, I think. Um, uh, it's like over in here or something. Oh, hey, nuts. Take those. Um, it's not over here. Oh, more nuts. I'll take those. Um, is it up over here? I remember it's like like really like strewn about. Was it? Ah, oh, there it is. Over there. Okay. I knew it was over here somewhere. Yeah, so like starts kind of up there and then kind of strewn about. Okay, so we got a couple of spitters here. Hey, bud. And the other one should have run off somewhere. Modular frame. Pick up some of these screws. I'll take the screws. Usually I skip the screws, but since I can't automate anything. It looks like their AI is just kind of frozen right now, but I mean, that's that's fine. Uh, these are computers. These are circuit boards, not computers. Oh, let me just organize stuff. So we have 17. I guess they were computers. They just had a different uh, image or something. Oh, there's some more stuff over here. More screws. I'll take those. Um, let's see what else do we got. Uh, anything down here? Yes, more modular frames. Okay, good. I think that's all of the stuff around here. All right, so what do you need? You need those, which I have. Fancy. Okay, so there's that one. Um, I think the next one... Uh, okay, which... So I know there's one like directly over there, but there's also one up against the water. Um, I think we'll go for that one next. I, I don't know if it's closer. It might be closer. It might not be closer. Who knows? But uh, we're going to go for it. Tried slide jumping. Kind of failed. Um, also, what are we at for time? We're at 33 minutes? Okay. Uh, more nuts. Okay, we got some uh, poisonous fog. That's always lovely. All right. So now we're getting over to the ocean. I think it's right down here. I could be wrong, though. More nuts. Thank you. Okay, MAM is done. We can check that out real quick. I just want to make sure there's no critters around. Okay, good. Nothing following me. All right, uh, MAM. Pure iron ingot. That one is definitely one that I want. Uh, bolted frame is useful, but this one, I think, will allow me to make even better use of my iron resources and there's the crash right down right down there uh, some nuts over here um, okay so we got a bunch of these little nest looking things so I'm gonna smack this one real quick and then I will smack that one real quick 
All right. You smack them fast enough and they don't... Oh, hey, motors. Nice. Uh, you smack them fast enough and they don't spawn heavy modular frames. That makes me happy. This one had all kinds of good stuff on it. Pretty happy with that. Anything else kind of in the water? No. Is that pretty much it? Okay. Uh, 30 megawatts. I think that's just a single biomass burner. Uh, you can go there. You can grab some of that. This can now open. Good to go. Oh, did I uh, throw the next hard drive in the man? I did not. Okay. There we go. Uh, just going to jump up on top of here, see if I can... Eh, doesn't look like there's anything else. Okay, um, the next one is going to be up that way. And kind of, so do you know where the uh, the nitrogen gas is? It's sort of like the nitrogen gas is kind of like down over there. It's just like right up the hill from there. And it's raining. Oh, uh, speaking of the rain, they did this really cool thing uh, with the, the uh, not the platforms, but um, uh, the foundations, where if it's raining, like, they actually look wet. And, like, another cool thing, so there's the nitrogen over there, so we're, like, right up there. So you just got to get around here, and I think we should be pretty close. I would appreciate it if you didn't shoot at me, Mr. Large Spitter. Uh, is that going to be a death trap? Probably. Um, yep, that hurt a little bit. Not as bad as I thought. But, okay, so we need to get kind of around and then up that way. That is a long way down. That is a very long way down. Okay, we got a little ledge here. I uh, will take it. All right, good to go. More nuts, I uh, will take it. Um, okay. Is there a way up here? No, okay. But yeah, so like this looks like it's actually wet, you know? So it's, it's just kind of cool. So now I know that we got to get up this way. I think we're kind of taking the long way around, but you know, it's fine. I think these are all like clams or mollusks or something. There's a lot of them all over the place. Okay, so we got the huge bridge thing. Oh, we got spiders. Hey, little spiders. I mean, if your AI wants to break on me and make it easier for me to kill you, I mean, I'm completely okay with that. Okay, so this is the huge bridge. Um, and I think... Uh, is that a bigger or a little spider? That's a big spider. Ouch. Hey, come back here. Give me your spider remains. I will turn it into biofuel. Okay. Oh, hey. Yellow power slug. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. No one said he had to be launching all that stuff against me. Okay. Um, we need to go... Now I'm, like, heading backwards. Uh... Oh, hey. I mean, if you're just going to stand there and let me hit you, I mean, okay. All right. Now, all of this stuff I can turn into biofuel, and it's like 200 per. So with 16 of the spitter remains, I mean, that's like 3,200 biofuel. And I definitely want to look into, or the solid bio, whatever, nugget things. Um, but I want to look into the actual liquid biofuel. Because I don't know how efficient that is, like, compared to oil. 
but I'm thinking it might be kind of something useful. All right, so now we're on the beach. So I think we're way, way past where we need to be, but you know, it is what it is. Hey there, bud. Oh, hey, look, it's little guys. Come here, little guy. I will take that. Are you like frozen in fear right now? Yes? Okay. I will kill you too. Um, okay, so we need to get up here. I feel like we took like a really, really, really long way around to get to this thing. Um, but I think, uh, I don't know how close we are actually, but I think we're getting close. It's like up over here somewhere. Ew, nuts. I'll take those, thank you. Um, oh, and a blue slug. I definitely need the blue slug. I haven't found one yet. So I will take that. Thank you. This semi-slug seems to emit unfamiliar energy readings, which could potentially be retrofitted into Fixit technology. A new research tree can now be accessed in the map. All right, so found this there it is uh we're gonna take these things out hopefully quickly before they launch and i think we are good to go okay so we have some of that uh, i thought i saw a motor and yeah, grab some motors down here is there anything else i mean we got this thing that requires four rotors which we have good to go um all right, is that, oh no, there's a computer or a circuit board here. Computer, okay. Is there anything else? I think that's it. Um, okay, so the next one is basically right next to the desert starting area or the beginner desert starting area, not like the hardcore desert starting area. Um, so that's going to be basically straight south from here, I think. Got some more spitter guys. I'll kill him because I can. I mean, that's free biofuel for me, so I will definitely take it. Oh, nuts. Nice. Um, okay, so we need to go. That is not supposed to be like that, but okay. Um, okay, so I think it's like down over there. I think, but let's uh, keep going. And, ooh, this is probably gonna hurt. Nope, didn't hurt, all right, good. Can we jump down here? I mean, kinda, sorta. Is that sulfur? This is sulfur, all right. I'll pick some of this up too. shows this is a mix of sulfide and sulfate minerals. It could be an indication of recent volcanic activity. A new research tree exploring volatile self-defense applications can now be accessed in the MAM. Volatile self-defense applications. Get her done. All right, we got another power slug over here with his little defenders. Hey, come here. your remains okay come here bud uh, remains 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 there we go uh, power slug good to go all right um, okay so if that's that I think we need to go that way. Uh, I'll pick up these nuts as well. The food is always good, and I think I saw some more over here. Good to go. Yep, right there. Okay. That one has another couple of hogs. Though I'm only seeing one at the moment, which makes me a little nervous. Oh, you died already? Oh, that was fast. Uh, there we go. 
Okay, modular frames. What else do we have? Yeah, there's the other one right there. Some wire. Okay. Cable. Take it. This is all just like free stuff here, so. Uh, 21 rotors. I think I can make those. So. Eh, water extractor. Nice. Oh, no, that's not the right one. I need a craft bench. Um, okay, so yeah, I can make lots of rotors. Uh, it said I needed 21. So that's what, eight more? And the mam is done, which is good. And I'll make like 25 just so I have like a couple extra rotors. Just in case. There, that'll be good. Take that out. Grab the hard drive. Thank you. All right, and then uh, ma'am. Okay, so copper alloy ingot. Um, I mean, honestly, probably not what I need. Uh, I can make some bio coal if I wanted to. Um, is that the best use of that? Or I could also make a copper rotor. Um, so instead of using iron rods, uh, it's, but then it also makes three. So I think this is probably the better option here. All right, next one. Oh, and then there's a, there's kind of a bug with the man. Like I'm not pushing any buttons right now, but I'm walking. Um, it seems like if you are walking when you enter into the MAM, like it'll stop you because you're, you know, accessing the MAM, but it's not going, it's like going to remember that you were moving and then when you exit out of it, like you re resume that movement even if like you weren't actually pushing the button. So just a uh, little interesting things. Um, obviously not intentional, so they'll probably fix it. All right, so the next one, I believe, let's see if that's the starting area there. That's the waterfall there. Um, I think we have to go this way. Um, at least I think it's that way. I don't. Uh, I don't remember. I know it's on the other side of this large one. So, but I don't remember if it's on that side or that side. Maybe we'll go this way. I'm sure, we'll find it. What are you? Stop. Make such terrifying noises. Okay, so it's not, oh, there it is, over there. Okay, so it was on the other side. My bad. Okay, and this one is guarded by a little launcher thing. Not anymore. Oh, two launchers, but they're now dead. Uh, okay, so those are actual circuit boards, good. Some wire, more circuit boards. Uh, let's see, anything else? Some um, screws, I will take those. Do, 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 do. I think that's everything. 30 megawatts, okay. Power, biomass. Sir, place, please, thank you. Uh, there we go, you can go there, do that. You're good to go. All right. All right, so next one is right up there. We can see that pretty easily. Um, the easiest way to get up there is to go over to the Caterium and then go from the Caterium up to there. So we're gonna go and do that. Uh, if you didn't know, there's Caterium right up here. So you can tell that I play this game way too much when I know where stuff is. All right, so we need to get So what would be the easier way to do this? Um, I think I kind of want to do this and then do like a ladder. But then again, that, hang on, let me, okay, so we'll do that and then we'll go over, oh, I don't have the ladder yet. Dang it. Okay, so we can't do that. Uh, we could do this. 
Um, or we could do this. What uses more resources? I think this is probably cheaper. Oh, but that needs to be on a foundation. Okay, fine. So then we'll do this. Oh, and I need to zoop it too. Come on, get your act together. There we go. Now I think there's the little nest looking things up here. Yeah, so, and I think there's more than one. Yep. Okay, so here's the Caterium. It is a pure node. And then we need to get up there. But we've already made like half the distance. So that's good. And we'll grab this little power slug. Really? You're gonna spit at me and then run away? Rude. Anyways. Okay, uh, so. Let's see how exactly we can get up onto here. And this needs to go down basically as far as it can go. Just right there. I mean, it's good enough, right? All right, so there is a large spitter up here, and I think there's also a couple nests. So we kind of need to clear out the nests first because those are actually the bigger, uh, the bigger problem. Oh, and it's poison things. Okay, but you can see the nest right there, and there's also a large spitter. Yeah, so you can, there's a large spitter right there. Now, is that the only nest? No, there's another one right there, hiding. See how this works? Sneaky. And then he's going to start launching, and then he's going to start launching, and this is just its just a very dangerous area. But we can go up here, and we can jump over to that guy, take him out. And then we can... Oh, I almost ran right into that. Okay, so there is the large spitter taken care of. Uh, poison everywhere, obviously. Uh, now we need to wait for these things to calm down. Oh, can't get that close. Okay. So it looks like there is a circuit board over there, some modular frames, couple of them. Um, can't really see much else. So I'm going to run over there, grab those, run back, and then we'll do another run and then unlock that. So here we go. Okay, and then a circuit board, and then modular frames. And then is that everything? I think that's everything. All right. Now we need to hop back up onto here, let him calm down. Oh, and there's another circuit board right there. I need to get that one. Okay. Let me just get that real quick. It's going to not make him very happy, but you know what? He can deal with it. Uh, four rotor. It's a good thing I made those extra four rotors. Jeez. Okay. So there's that. And now I think we've got everything that we need. Is there anything else over here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Next one is going to be up over here somewhere. It's over in there somewhere. I think it might be right there. But the way that we get to it, and there's another one up there, but that one I don't think we can open yet because we don't have the parts for it. Um, the way that we get to the one that's over here, though, is actually through that cave. So there's like a little side passage that you can take and actually takes you up the cliff like halfway. And then, uh, that is not the right way down. Hey, bud. All right, so now we need to find our way down. Good to go. We'll slide because we like sliding. Uh, 
Uh, how are we for time? We are at 54 minutes already? Jeez, dude. Okay. There's that guy. Is that a big guy or a little guy? Why is he running around so much? It's weird. What are you doing? All right. Oh, that's probably gonna hurt. Okay. But that's okay. So, uh, we need to find the cave that's over here. Um, and I think it's right there. And there used to be like something swimming in here. I don't think it's in here anymore. I think they took it out. But it was like a shark or like a huge octopus or something. I don't know. It was just big. And then we need some of this bacon. Take the bacon. All right, so cave should be here, I think. I could be wrong. I don't think I'm wrong, but I could be wrong. Yeah, there it is, right there, okay. And then there's a couple of small spitters at the entrance. You can just ignore them. So there's one right there. All right, so there are a couple of nests around here because they've got that uh, yellow power slug there. So you need to be very careful, but the side passage is actually through there. So we'll get rid of this guy. I thought there was another one. Yeah, right there. He's kind of hiding though. There's another one right there. Uh, we'll take care of you, I think. And then let's see if we can hop up onto, oh, I was up there, okay. And then we'll hop up onto here, hop up onto here. Good to go. Okay, ma'am is done again. Go ahead and figure that out. What do we got? Okay, so iron alloy ingot, and there was also the copper. Okay, this one I want. Yeah. I mean, this one is good too, but that one for now. Um, and that's generally not the one that you would want to pick, um, but given the, you know, difficulty with which I've assigned myself this game, um, that one would likely be, I think, the better option. Because I basically have as much quartz as I want. Um, please don't tell me I'm stuck in here. Okay, good. All right, and we'll make our way through here. I think there's spiders in here. I could be wrong, there's mycelium, which I also need to pick up. The mycelia within this fungus suggest strong molecular bonding features frequently observed in adhesives and medicine, both beneficial for field research. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Nice. don't know how much I'm gonna need, but I'm just gonna take that. Grab this little slug guy right here. All right, so this does take you up the mountain, like I said. And then we need to hang a left here. We got a couple of nests. Um, yeah, we'll go after it. Okay, that guy's dead. I'll leave that one for now. All right. Some more nests, we're gonna go after them as well. Remember, all of this is free biomass. All right, and then we need to get up there. Uh, that? Oh, hey. Oh, I missed one. Sir, rude. Yeah, those can be very dangerous. Okay, we got a spitter here. Are you frozen? Okay, I took that to the face, but you know, it's fine. I uh, can't jump up there. Can I get up here? Yes, I can. All right. I thought, oh, we got a couple of nests up here too. 
was annoying. Is there a third one? I hope not. Uh, circuit board, okay. Got some cable, more stuff here. More circuit boards, good to go. Um, screws, I'll take those. Ooh, take those as well. I think that's everything. And we got another spitter over there, but he's fine. We'll just leave him for now. Uh, 10 solid biofuel. I can make that. Uh, okay. If you don't mind. And we'll make that as well. And then we'll make that. This is super fun, right? Good for a drink break. All right, I think that should be good. Um, take that apart. Solid biofuel, thank you. Another hard drive. All right. Um, okay, so there is another one up there. There's also aluminum up there as well. Uh, we cannot open that one yet. So then the next place that we would wanna go is along the beach here. Uh, there's one over there by the beach and then over on the far side of the beach, uh, right before you get to the plains biome, um, there's another, actually there's supposed to be another one over there by the Caterium, but when I did my little playthrough before I made this series, uh, it wasn't actually there. Like the wreck was there, but the actual thing that you can, you know, get the hard drive out of was not. Um, And then I suppose the only other places that we could go after this is up in the coal area. Uh, there's a couple of wrecks over there as well. Um, do you think we can get those like swinging on the way back maybe? Uh, but I think, I think we're actually pretty good for now. I mean, we've got lots of biofuel potential here, so there's another 200 right there, biomass anyways. Uh, we're going to hop down this way, take the shortcut down. All right. And now we have to hit the ramp over here because you can't get up from that side. So, all right. Now there is a large spitter over here and I think four of the hogs. That's what they're calling them, right? Hogs. So you just gotta kinda run past them all. More nuts. So there's the big spitter right there. We're just gonna scoot by him. Hopefully he doesn't see us. But then again, he might be frozen as well. Who knows? Then here's all of the hogs here. They're just doing their thing. All you really have to do is just like smack one of them and they'll all run away. So. Okay, so now once we cross this little lake right here, uh, we're over in the coal area, but we want to go directly across because that is where the next wreck is. And you can see like if you're jumping out of the water, you can actually make it across the water pretty quickly. All right, so it should be right there. Okay, and I think this one needs power. Oh, and it's got a big guy. Hey, big guy. What are you doing? Oh, there's a little guy there, too. Get out of here. Anyways. So there's that. Um, motors, good. Uh, that, good. Okay, what else we got? Some wire. 
Uh, can't pick up any more wire. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? Yeah, 50 megawatts. Okay, so that's going to be two of the biomass burners. I'll throw a pole here. Connect that. Connect that. Connect that. Um, all right. Uh, we'll throw in some flowers, and then we'll throw in some leaves. Call that good. Open this guy up. Good. All right. There's that. Okay, we can't pick up the wire, so that's fine. I think that's all of the important things. Wait, no, is that? No, that's just scrap, okay. So now it gets interesting. Um, the next one is actually kind of the opposite direction where we wanna go, so our base is like that way. You can see the space elevator there. But the next one is like way over there and we are over an hour, so I think I'm just gonna head back to base. Now, there should be a ramp down, but it goes through the poison. Um, so we're just gonna kinda go with it and hopefully we don't die. I hear spitters. Grab some more of these little pale berries, thank you. Um, is there water down here? There is not. Okay, but there's the ramp down, so we need to go through the poison and then down that way. And then if you go out this way, I think there might be another wreck down in there, but there's also like three or four large spitters. And I'm not feeling confident enough in my thwacking abilities to be able to take on all of them. So, let's see how this goes. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Okay, that wasn't bad. We took two hits. All right. So this is kind of like, it's like a roadway that kind of wraps around like the middle of the mountain over here. Um, but there is water below us, so we should be able to just kind of hop off and do a really deep dive into the water. Um, yeah, should be fine, I think. <laughs> this is terrifying. Uh, is this deep? Hopefully this is deep. Okay, it's deep. All right, and then, uh, oh, that's all poison here. Okay, so we will go, we will not go down there. Wait, no. Wait, no, we can go down there. Yeah, yeah, because that'll take us down to where the space elevator is. And then, how did I take damage? I landed in water. That was weird. Sorry, I'm just trying to swim fast, and the only way that you can really do that is by continually jumping. But I'm like failing on like most of the jumps here, so. And I wanna stay away from those guys if I can. I think we should be far enough out. All right, and we made it through, good to go. And we are basically back at our base. And we have a lot of hard drives to go through, so that will be good. All right. Good to go. We are back, and I think that will be it for this video. Uh, should be, uh, wow, we have a lot of stuff, like a lot of stuff, holy crap. Oh, and I didn't do another hard drive? Okay, fine. Um, hang on, before I do this, I'm gonna get all of these things going. Okay, there's that one. I need 25 rotors for this, are you kidding me? Um, can do this one. So that's slug scanning. And then this one I need a power shard. Okay, let me make a power shard real quick. 
There we go. Grab some plates. Thank you. Go back over into here. Power slugs. There we go. So this is what I really need. Because now I can go through uh, my whole build over there and kind of adjust things to where they need to be. That'll be good to go. Um, but yeah. So I think I'm going to just kind of chill here and go through all the hard drives. Um, it's going to take me over an hour, so it should be fun. Um, but I think that'll be it for now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And if you did, hopefully you'll join me for the next one. But until then, have a good one.